It's really sad. The only time I see you anymore is on the show. I know. We have, I, I have to write a book to be able to see you. I know. You know. I haven't seen you in a while. You look fantastic. Thank you. You look great. And I love your book. I read it as soon as I got it. And uh, it's, it's, a, it's an easy read. And it's uh, obviously a lot of stuff that I already know. But I think it's, it's really you. so informative for so many people. Why do you call it the lean? Well, I'm a big fan of leaning into change, you mm -hmm. know? So this is, this is a book about weight loss, so it's about getting lean, but it's also about doing it in an easy way, just sort of leaning into it. So what I, I never understood people who, you know, these diets, they make you, you give up everything and it's like white knuckling through the process and it's really difficult and you miss all your favorite foods and then you, you, you stick with it for whatever, 21 days or, or a month and then you're, you're done with it and you just yo-yo back to your own, your right. own way. So this way you're adding in little steps that are very doable, very practical, you know, not very taxing, and you're crowding out the old habits. Mm -hmm. And so you're just leaning into this shift and it happens really easily. Yeah, I mean, one of the things, and I, it, it kind of, you know, I think everybody knows this, but one of the things is to drink eight glasses of water a day to start filling up, especially before you eat. Yeah. Which is something that you so just easy. remind it's... yourself you just have to do it all day long. Yeah, and that's that's day one. So mm -hmm. the first day, it's like I, I want everyone to know that it's not that difficult. All you have to do is drink water. And it's amazing how often we forget to drink water, but when you drink water, you're actually... Um, hydrating your metabolism. So your metabolism is working better. Mm -hmm. Everything's working optimally. All your organs are working better. Sometimes you think you're hungry, but when you're, you are, you're really thirsty. Mm -hmm. And so when you drink water, it's called preloading. And there's, there's a study that came out of um, Germany that when people drink water, two cups before they have a meal, they actually lose five pounds of fat more than people who don't drink water before meals. So mm -hmm. that's a real easy thing that you can do. Yeah. And then another step, there's, there's uh, all these different it's a 30-day plan, and you really do kind of help people go through it. And one is to give up cow's milk for a non-dairy form of milk. Yeah, and yeah. Well, here's the thing about cow's milk. If you think about it, um, a cow who is lactating is feeding her little baby calf. And she is, it's perfectly designed by nature to make that calf grow to 1,500 pounds right. really it, quickly. It, it kind of makes sense when you think about it. <laughs> I mean, the cow is supposed to become fat, docile, and slow very quickly. Right. You know? And so why would we want that? We don't want to be fat, docile, and slow. We want to be quick in our feet. We want to be lean and mean. You know, even when we're, we're, we're breastfeeding, you know, as, as humans, we don't do it after, you know, after a few years. Years, certainly at the most. You shouldn't anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, think about this, Ellen. Think if I, if I called you up and I said, hey, come on over to my house. You know, I had just had a baby or something. And I said, you know, I have a little extra breast milk and I decided to make some ice cream with it. So come right. on over for some, for some yeah. ice cream. We would not be friends. <laughs> <laughs> I would not be your friend. <laughs> But yet, yeah. we drink yeah. the milk, the, right. the breast milk of a cow. Right. You know, I know. It just doesn't make sense at all. Um, another thing that I started doing, because I started following some of these things, because here's the thing, you know, being vegan, and I certainly have lost a lot of weight, and my body has changed since I've been vegan, but you can easily gain weight being vegan, too. So you have to kind of really watch what you, you eat. You want to be healthy. Yeah. Right. So Because I can easily go to the other kinds of foods that are yeah. still vegan. Chips. But Yes. Uh, <laughs> but, but now, eating an apple a day even yeah. makes a difference because because it, it's fiber and it fills you up, and I'm doing all these things that I'm going, oh, that's, yeah. big, you know. Three an apple. apple a day not only keeps the doctor away, but it keeps the pounds away, too. Right. And it actually melts the pounds away, because when you are eating an apple, it's chock full of fiber, like you said, so it's about, it's, it's really a quarter of the fiber that you need per day, and it's got a special kind of fiber called pectin, and pectin is what they use to make jams and jellies. It's that gelling agent, mm -hmm. and so it's in your belly, and it actually causes the food to leave your stomach uh, twice as slowly. So that means you're going to feel full twice mm -hmm. as long. That means you're not going to be hungry. You're not going to have those cravings. Mm -hmm. And your your body breaks down the sugars in naturally occurring in food much mm -hmm. more slowly so you don't have all these crazy mood swings. Yeah. Well, that's another thing, too. I mean, just getting off of sugar, because sugar really can 
you know, uh, mess, mess you up. Mm -hmm. I mean, and it's hard to get off sugar. And the flax seed, which is just adding a little bit of flax seed, that's another thing in here that is Super so easy. good for you. Two tablespoons of flax seed, and you can put it in a smoothie, you can put it in a soup, you can put it in your lasagna, whatever, to, to thicken things. Mm -hmm. And again, that fills up your stomach. So this is all about crowding out. Mm -hmm. You know, you're really taking taking um, away all this, this hunger because you're putting mm -hmm. all this great stuff in. And that's nothing. Two tablespoons yeah. of flax seed, that's easy. Everyone has that. Everyone Everyone has an apple, everyone can drink water. It's nothing expensive, it's very doable. But what happens over time, what you do on day one, you're also gonna do on day two. So you're gonna eat mm -hmm. an apple on day one, two, three. Yeah. So you're gonna add in all these different things. Right. That by day 30, you've, you've created all these different habits that leaves you no room for the old stuff. Right, and it's just, it, it's really, it's so, it makes you feel stronger and more vibrant and so many good things.